make sure you hit that subscribe button, make sure you ring that notification bell, and make sure to share this with everyone you know to help us beat that massive YouTube algorithm. Hashtag I like Luke Skywalker. Scrolling through Twitter today, I saw the dumbest article link that a lot of people probably have already seen. This, this article's been out for days now. Apparently, apparently, The Last Jedi showed people actually liked Luke Skywalker. Not Hermit Luke Skywalker. But Luke Skywalker. How is this just now becoming a thing? Seriously. People have only been screaming about this movie for years. And honestly, had I been doing channels about, you know, the the conversations I was having with friends at the time about this stuff, would have already talked about this. The whole thing that ruined Star Wars. Yeah, The Last Jedi was... It, it, the Last Jedi could have been survived. It, it could have been considered an okay Star Wars movie had all they done is just not change Luke Skywalker to the weird Hermit Walker. Like, I liked Luke Skywalker, not Luke Hermit Walker. There's a very big difference in those two characters. And it just seems that so many people are tone deaf to this idea. That, well, why can't you just accept that, you know, he he changed over the course of 30 years? I'm like, because Luke Skywalker's not a real person. And I would still like to see the hope and faith and stuff like that because we literally had a time jump there that wasn't explained or any of that. Why is it so unbelievable for people to be like, wow, you guys, you just you just liked the the farm kid that turned into the savior of the galaxy? You guys really like that story? Huh? Wow. Yeah. The guy who was unbelievably hopeful, who was loyal to his friends, who was one of the just, just, just coolest characters in pop culture for the longest time. Really? Really? You're... People are just now starting to get this in the media. I, I just, I, 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 I had to just, they're tone deaf. They don't know what they're doing. They genuinely think that just throwing in, uh, pick a pronoun type of character into any sort of a movie is just good. That makes it good. Just pick a pronoun, insert pronoun here. That makes the movie good. They don't have to worry about character evolution, characters changing. They don't have to worry about good villains. They don't have to worry about good world building. They don't have to worry about establishing promising lore. You know, maybe setting up unanswerable mysteries. You know, uh, uh, things that you know, not not mystery boxing because that's just stupid. But they literally think that just by having Mark Hamill in the movie, we were just going to fall in love. And it was just going to be Disney's Star Wars is the best Star Wars. No. We actually cared enough to follow this series for 30, 40 years. I mean, I'm not even 30 years old and I've been watching these since I was a kid. They were out well before my time, at least the original trilogy. Grew up with the prequels myself. You know, but we all knew that it led to this hopeful change to the galaxy. So yeah, I do like Luke Skywalker. But I liked Luke Skywalker. Guess what? If you change someone's personality, they're no longer that person anymore. And that's for real life and in fiction. I would hope that I become a better person tomorrow, which means that who I am today will not be who I am tomorrow. And if you do a radical change like that, then all of a sudden, you don't have Luke Skywalker anymore. And people kind of go, wait a minute, where did Luke go? Why isn't he here? Anyway, I just wanted to rant on that, rant over. Hopefully you guys like, comment, and subscribe down below. I appreciate it, but I just had to rant on this. Yes, I like Luke Skywalker. Yes. I like Luke Skywalker. What a concept. Thank you for watching A Drink With Crazy. If you liked the conversation, make sure to click here to see more.